Hot and sunny weather still sticking around through Friday and probably most of Saturday too. You might see a couple puffy clouds on Saturday, but still pretty much uh, hot weather around. As we get towards Sunday, the clouds may start to increase and we could actually start to see a couple showers around depending on how much moisture it can get in here, but I bet we'll be a little more on the cloudy side, probably mostly cloudy on Sunday. That could keep temperatures cooler, not cool, cool, but you know, not 100 degrees, but a little cooler on Sunday and some showers maybe popping up here and there, especially right along the coast. Tomorrow though, it's looking like today. Look at today's temperatures right now. We're at 100 in McAllen, 103 in Rio Grande City and 96 in Harlingen, 89 now in Brownsville after being in the 90s earlier. But it's going to not be as cool the next few days and not very cool at night either. Just not much of a, a cool down coming anytime soon besides the clouds when they arrive on Sunday. The heat index, how hot it feels with the humidity, which the humidity is still rising. It's been gradually climbing the last couple of days, but the heat index is 105 in McAllen. This how hot it feels if you're standing in shade when you factor in the humidity. Even 101 in Raymondville and 97 in Brownsville. And those dew points are on the way up. The average number is about 67, but it kind of ranges from the mid 70s in some of the coastal counties over Cameron and Wilsey counties to about the low 60s in Star County. So uh, the humidity, though, is still kind of creeping in from the southeast off the Gulf. Your evening planner, kind of warm and muggy, 90s at 7 p.m., 80s at 9 p.m., and probably low 80s at 11. And we may only drop down to about 75 or 76 late tonight for lows with that increase in the humidity coming. Now, across uh, South Texas in the valley, you don't see anything really going on. It's clear out there. If you look out your window, I don't have a window to look out, but if you look out, <laughs> it's going to be nice and sunny and hardly a cloud anywhere in sight today. There is some moisture out in the Gulf. If you look at some of the clouds out here kind of hanging around, some of this moisture may try to get pushed back in gradually, especially by Sunday. So as that moisture comes in, it could cloud up the skies a bit more and bring back maybe a few showers around. Future, future track kind of shows this too. If you look this evening and tonight, we keep getting more humidity with mainly clear skies. And then by tomorrow morning, there's 8 a.m. Tries to show maybe a couple of little clouds near the coast, but I think tomorrow is mainly just another sunny day. There might be a couple of little puffy clouds now and then, but mainly just sunshine again and hot temperatures. For Saturday, too, we may see a few clouds in the morning. Future track tries to say a sprinkle. I think that's probably overdone in the morning, but mostly sunny skies return on Saturday. Maybe a few more puffy clouds, but uh, generally a nice, bright, sunny day. As we get into Sunday, though, if you have plans Sunday, you see future track tries to show some rain. This might be a little on the heavy side, but with a lot of moisture coming back in and the way the atmosphere is set up, it may kind of trap the clouds around. So we may be looking at a mostly cloudy day much of Sunday and at least a couple of light rain showers here and there, but it doesn't look like widespread heavy rain anytime soon. But I think Sunday overall won't be nearly as sunny. Uh, first one five uh, forecast here the next three days for rain. Dry tomorrow, dry on Saturday, 20% chance for rain on Sunday. I would say overall your better chances would be over Cameron and Wilsey County is kind of right near the coast. So first one five seven day forecast highs around 98 tomorrow, but that's going to range from the upper 80s near the coast to probably about 103 in Star County. Saturday, maybe a couple degrees cooler, but still mostly sunny, hot and humid. And the humidity really comes up and stays up. When you see those nighttime lows kind of around 77 or 78, that means it's it's almost kind of like midsummer humidity out there for Sunday through early next week. And we could start to see a couple showers here and there in spots on Sunday, Monday, and really through next week. But I think most of the time and in most places, it's just going to be kind of partly to mostly cloudy. But, you know, those clouds may keep temperatures slightly cooler. You know, Carrie, we're talking maybe like 94 instead of, you know, 100. So I liked last week's <laughs> forecast a whole lot better. Oh, last week was awesome. It was beautiful. Uh, but, you know, it'll come back, just not next week. The week after? Maybe. The week after I wouldn't that. guarantee it. <laughs> Sometime before Christmas. I'll negotiate with him, guys. Yeah. Don't worry about it. All right. Well, now to that.